they call me E. I was never given a last name, but this was only the first case of identity theft. I know what you've heard about me, that I was carved out of the ribcage of a man after some afterthought, but make no mistake, they have burned down my libraries and tried their best to scorch my memory, but I remember well the sweetness of God's breath on the back of my neck when she whispered me into existence. She told me I would be the first of this new species she was experimenting with. There was no talk of dominion, but she did teach me a certain harmony with Lady Gaia and told me to embody her beauty, so I walked tall. Wide hips and extra weight to nourish the children I would carry, and as they grew, I taught them, taught the young, the small, the weak, taught them plenty. They came to my crown and asked me how to run their nations. Aristotle, Plato, Socrates, sucked from the supple breast of my knowledge. Little did I know when I turned my back, they'd whip slave ships into it and create this Bible. That blames me for the expulsion from the Garden of Eden, but there was no snake that tempted me to leave the promised land. I'm pretty sure those were your guns chains and aggression. So was it fruit or the middle passage that closed Eden's gates, this Bible, that tells me childbirth is a curse and I am the cause? Well, I am sorry. Sorry that I broke my back to carry your children, but if you ever dared to ask me, I'd call you the curse. I've been called temptress, but it was you who stripped me naked, called me slut, and made me hit my knees until I knew what forbidden fruit really tasted like. And the abuse didn't stop after Lincoln. It was just heavily disguised as the media, tossing me a pair of booty shorts and telling me to sway my hips to the rhythm of lynch ancestors because it reminds racists of a better time. They never look me in the eye because they want me to forget that I have them, so that I can ignore the Planned Parenthoods that huddle around my black neighborhoods with advertisements, making them as appealing as Easy Bake Ovens to child Hitler. I have been waiting for the UN to step in and label it genocide, but I am only met with government officials planting cocaine into my son's body until he is addicted in jail or dead. I know why they do it. They see her image in me, and they fear my power. They sold me as commodity so that I would forget what I was worth. But you should have smashed my mirrors first. Did you think I couldn't see? I am the beauty of gold embodied. Black skin, as beautiful as the galaxies they stole from my libraries, but not from my eyes. You can keep your idealistic paintings of me, but you will never bleach my skin or straighten my hair. Forbid the native drums of my tongue, but you will never quiet the lavish language of my dance. I will never lose my kinks, my fight, my fire. Save your cat calls for those deserving, because I do not play with rats. You will call me, you will call me goddess or you will not address me at all. 